Well, hello everyone, it's Dave Constable with Lady Antiquity Estate Liquidations bringing you another estate sale. This time it's in Hampton, 45 Willard Avenue, Hampton, Virginia, okay? This is going to be the 13th through the 15th. So that's a Thursday through Saturday of December. And uh, it's gonna be a great sale. We actually have a couple cars for sale. The details will be listed in the, in the details of the the estate sale on estatesale.net at ladyantiquity.com under current estate sales we also have a jeep that's going to be for sale again all the details will be listed on this as far as the mileage the gear all those kind of things so let's go folks let's go in and take a tour this is for sale also this this buick lucerne okay 148,000 miles, but it's clean. It's really, really clean. You're gonna like it. Let's take the tour. So it's 45 Willard Avenue. It's the 13th through the 15th. Numbers will be handed out at 8.30 on Thursday. Doors open at 9 a.m. All right, let's go. Ooh, it's cold outside, so. We've got a really nice sofa here, very comfy. Great for your den, great for your man cave. There's some nice things in here. And I'll just sort of walk through and let you get an idea of what we have, okay? Some nice wall hangings. Here's a really cool TV stand. The TV does not go with it, but there's a really nice stand for your TV. Lots of drawer space, lots of room to put things. And over here on our table, we've got some nice knives. Those are very popular. Those will go quickly. A video monitoring camera. Here's a really unique clock. I want you to see this. You're going to really like this. I've never seen one like this, but uh, very unique. Here we go there. Some vintage items right here. A projector, a microscope. That looks like a card table of some sort. It's very nice though. Let's go on into the, to the bedroom. We've got a nice futon couch bed here. Another really comfortable it looks. How about some snowshoes? High back chair, pretty, pretty nice. A lot of nice pieces here. And here's a beautiful high boy dresser. That's really nice. Some linens, some wall coverings, clothing. Here's a beautiful helmet. This helmet is really nice. You're gonna, you're gonna like this one. That's going to go quickly. There's a nice cabinet. And don't forget to uh, also look at the pictures. So we do the video that sort of takes you on a tour, but we also have pictures that you can reference. So go ahead and do that. Gives you a little bit more time to take a look at an individual item. Here's a drop leaf table. Comes with four chairs. And here's the chairs. That's a nice addition to a little kitchen. Uh, and it's a space saver, so you can put those leaves down or you can put them up, all depending on your space. You've got some kitchen items here and some pots and pans. Always come in handy. You don't need to go to the store and buy these things because we get great items at Lady Antiquity Estate Liquidations. All right, let's go on. Sorted to the backyard, we've got a nice trunk right here. Some vintage bottles. These are always highly collectible. And let's go on out to the back. Here's a nice seat that doubles as a chest. It opens up. That's gonna go pretty quickly. 
And let me try to back down the stairs as we speak. And don't forget, this is 45 Willard Avenue in Hampton, Virginia. It's going to be on the 13th through the 15th of December. That's a Thursday through Saturday. Doors open at 9 a.m. And we hand out numbers on Thursday at 8.30 a.m. So get here early. Get your number. Especially if you see something you like. You got to stake your claim to it. Or otherwise, it'll be gone fast. There's a barbecue grill. Here's a nice chest. A metal chest. That's nice. That's going to go fast. How about this? Look at all this nautical stuff. Look at all the buoys and different things on the fence. Check out this big chain. That's just cool as can be. It's heavy. Look at that. Look at the size of this rope. That's just awesome. Love that. How would that look on your fence? On your wood fence? On your chain link fence? On the side of your house? It's very cool. You want a rustic look, you want a nautical look in your backyard, there you go. How about a gazebo? I believe we do have the cover, I'll verify that, but how about a gazebo? This is a one that's pretty sturdy, it'll mount to the ground, okay? It's not one of the pop-up ones, it's a, it's a one that should be stood there and mounted to the ground. Or you can mount it to a deck, however you like. All right, let's go on into one of the sheds. Here's some yard art, some bird feeders. And there's a nice stand to put the bird feeders on. That's really a pretty stand, by the way. Let's go into the, the first shed. You get an idea. You've got some automobile products here, some lights that go on the front of your, your truck. Here's some seat covers. You've got motorcycle seats, motorcycle accessories and parts. Uh, how about some, some hooks and clamps and things like that. Check this out. Those are nice. Guys just love these. I don't, I don't know. I just look at them and I like them for some reason. I don't know what I would do with them other than display them, but here's a winch. That's nice. You, you need that? Pull yourself out of a ditch. Here's a backup surge protector, K&N intake uh, air filter. Those are expensive, folks. If you know anything about K&N, those are expensive and high performance. Add horsepower to your vehicle. Here's some cleaning supplies and different things for automobiles. More down here. Lots for everyone. You need a gas tank? Well, you've got one right here. You've got many actually. A couple propane tanks, yard items here, power power items for your yard, blowers, hedge trimmer, chainsaw, all kinds of good things. How about some horseshoes? There you go. All right. Some ducks, a sailboat, a mini fridge right here. That's nice. Here you go. Want to want to cut your branches? up high but you don't want to get on a ladder there it is right there folks plug it in and cut those branches down how about this awesome slot machine my understanding is we have the key and it works so this is going to be a great find for someone right here some more rope this looks like some nautical rope with a, a anchor on the bottom of it there you have a boat, you want to anchor, go fishing, there you go. Tarps, straps, tie down straps. You got compressors, all kinds of good stuff over here. Here's a uh, carrier that goes behind your vehicle. You just push it right into your, your uh, receiver for your tow package and you're good to go. How about a brand new air conditioner? Never use a window AC. Brand new in the box. Okay, that's, that's going to be, I mean, you know, we're in the mid, middle of uh, the cold season, but why not be prepared? Get ready for next summer. It's going to be hot. We know that already. How about some old vintage tools? Check out that socket set. That's some big sockets there. 
you got a truck, you got big truck tires you need to take off. I mean, anything. This is this is for the person that has everything and needs nothing. But why not add this to your collection? Because the day comes that you need it, you have it. There's a nice vice. We have a lot of people that like vices. Pete comes to mind, a couple others. And a table full of miscellaneous items. And the floor full of miscellaneous items as well. A machete. The other tools on the shelf. You can see there's a whole lot to look through here, a whole lot to pick through. All right, so let's go on around and we'll go to the other shed. As we do, there's more on the side, yard art. Here's a fire pit, put your logs in there, get ready for winter. Have a little fire outside, roast some marshmallows, make some s'mores for the kids, you're good to go. There's a little propane uh, grill heater, just a burner, put your uh, your uh, clam bake on there, whatever you want to do. And then here's some different items for the yard. Okay, let's go into the other shed. We've got a uh, mosquito magnet. It kills mosquitoes. It attracts them and kills them. Why does it attract them? To keep them away from you. How about that? <coughs> here's a tankless water heater. You want to get rid of that water heater and have instant on hot water this is the one right here if you have a huge family eh, maybe not so much if you have it if it's just you and your your wife and one kid or something this is going to work you know you save electricity because your your uh, water heater is always on always heating that water this heats it as it comes through so that's a good good addition how about an olympic weight set these are olympic style plates olympic style weight bar it's a big 45 pound weight bar look at the big plates you got a great bench here with the leg extension and the leg curls incline bench no excuses i need that one there's a great chest here's a solar light set four piece so you got eight pieces there all together how about a new dishwasher? You need a under-the-counter dishwasher? They don't get much better than Bosch. German engineering folks. This is a nice one too. Stainless steel. Ready to go. Price to sell. Price to sell. You want to open up your own business? There you go. Cash register. Ready to go. Take the money. And there's a, a light for a lamp post. You got some shutters for your closet door. Just a little bit of everything. Pool table balls there. All kinds of stuff. There's some more seat covers on top of there. Workout videos. Here's a Nordic track. Portable AC. Dog feeder in the back. It looks like an electronic dog feeder. If you're too, uh, too lazy to get up and feed your dogs, let this feeder do it for you. <laughs> and I'm just kidding, folks. It is pretty cool, though. You're at, you're at uh, work or out for the day, schedule it to feed your dog at a certain time. Isn't that cool? And it just drops the food. It's awesome. So there's a lot, a lot for everyone. And I'll go around here, go around. We've got some pavers. Those are for sale. Let's go ahead and, and do this here. If I can get it with one hand, I don't know. There you go. How about a John Deere riding lawnmower with the bagger? Look at the shape of that. This He really took nice care of his equipment. It runs. It's going to be priced to sell. But don't try to negotiate, folks, because our prices are already the lowest in the business. So the price we put on it is the price you're going to pay. Day two, we're going to give 20 to 30% off. Day three, 50% off. So there won't be any negotiating because we don't have to because our prices are already the best so there you go and we love all you guys too by the way let me close this back up and then this fencing's for sale 
and then let's go over to the other side that bike that you see in the video is not for sale and we're to the other side now okay all right and here's another lawnmower there's a great push lawnmower works perfectly how about some masonry tools so floats these are vintage some of these are really really nice check this out this is a nice one go for about 45 dollars new all right you're going to get it at a fraction of the cost the steel almost a heavy bag there it is folks okay close this one back up and all right i did it sorry about the fingers in the video but it's hard to do that while you're trying to trying to film and close doors as well so i don't know if i got these bikes in there but here's here's the other bikes that are for sale these are vintage there's a schwinn and there's an old spalding so these are for the taking so that's pretty much it folks 45 willard avenue hampton virginia december 13th through the 15th doors open at 9 a.m numbers handed out at 8 30 a.m we look forward to seeing you and uh until then this is dave constable with lady antiquity estate liquidations signing out take care